floor. It's probably not what you'd expect to see the former high school teacher of a Yale professor and a professor at the Medical School of Wisconsin doing. But Tigerton High School science teacher Gary Kuchenbecker seems to march to the beat of his own drum. He's the reason I'm doing what I'm doing. Um, I, I, I was your typical high school student. I got C's, a couple of D's my first year. I didn't even think that you could do something with science. More than 10 years ago, Joe Carroll sat in Kuchenbecker's science classes. Today, he's an assistant professor at the Medical School of Wisconsin and a leading researcher in ophthalmology and color vision defects. Carroll isn't the only successful scientist to hail from these halls. And what you can see that's really amazing and shocked a lot of people is that nobody's the same. Ron Breaker, a 1982 THS grad, is now a professor at Yale and a leading researcher in DNA and RNA processes. Having grown up on a dairy farm near Tigerton, Breaker says his small town background was an advantage. So I think a good mix of uh, education on the farm and education in the classroom that helped me uh, get excited about, about science, uh, about how biology works. And for Kuchenbecker, it's exciting to see his former small town students succeed and make big impacts on the worldwide scientific community. It makes me feel very good. It's just a warm feeling you get. It doesn't come from the paycheck always, you know. <laughs> Even though he doesn't like taking the credit, these men say their experience in Kuchenbecker's classroom paved the way. So I've always been grateful to him for really opening my eyes to the fact that you can do something with, with math and science. In Tigerton, Chastity Wahlberg, News Channel 7.